Hearing everybody like scream back at the at the screen, or like you know, just like all the different types of laughter. I just think going to see a comedy in the theater is just a it's a it's a very you know that's what the theater going experience is all about. That's how it's supposed to be. These amazing girls on stage. It was a dream come true. Honestly, I would talk more and more about it, but there's not much more to say other than it was a dream. How many times do you have to repeat scenes because maybe they were even laughing about it? There were a few scenes where um, the, they, they broke a bunch, but it just means they're having fun and they're in the moment, so I'm not I'm not complaining. As a co-writer, speak about collaborating with Paul. What was your writing process like? What we do is we both write the same scenes, and then we read each other's scripts, we highlight our favorite, and then uh, we combine. So it really feels like our first draft is more like a third draft. What was your favorite scene to write? Um, I think... Even though it's a sad and hard scene to watch, the fight between the two girls was really satisfying. What was your favorite scene to see bring to life as a director? Same, the fight scene at the end with the girls. It's, it's real, it's emotional, and, I, and it's important. Thank you so much. Thank you. So how was that mouth-to-mouth -mouth scene? How was it to shoot? The mouth-to-mouth -mouth scene. Um, it, was, um, it was just that. There was times where um, uh, Scarlett it actually blew into my mouth, so I, I have um, had her blow air into me, like a, like a dead carcass, so basically it was, yeah. And you put on 14 kilograms for this roll, is that correct? That's right, yeah, I don't, I, I forget what kilos is, but yes, 25 pounds from 173 up to 197, so it was a lot of, um, it was a lot of working out, a lot of eating, and um, it was, it was fun, it was great fun to be able to be a part of it, yeah. And, and how many hours do you practice uh, the stripper dance? Ah, it was probably about five or six hours that I went and took some lessons. Um, my wife got pregnant during that process, uh, so maybe something did work. <laughs> and we now have a beautiful baby girl. Yeah, so that worked. Yeah, <laughs> Thank it did so work. Thank you. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Congratulations on the movie. Thank you so much. Tell me about the work you did on it. So I composed the score for the movie. Um, and it was just such a fun project to be a part of. So hilarious, so funny. Um, I got a really great opportunity to use different inspirations, different genres of music in the score and, and blend them all together. So I'm just so happy it's all come together and I'm standing here. How did you get involved? Uh, well, Sony approached me and, and sent me the script and asked me if I would be up for it. I read the script and it's very rare that I, uh, I will read a script and laugh out loud. So I was down from, from you know the first page and I eventually met with Paul and Lucia and uh, we had a great meeting in a very trendy bar in LA, and uh, and that's that. Now I'm standing here. Um, tell me what vibe you are going for with the music. So yeah, it's a, it's like a blend of. If I had to sum it up, it would be a blend of hip hop, Cuban Montuno influences, and you know modern action thriller music. What's your favorite scene? Uh, my favorite scene is probably the last kind of five to seven minutes of the movie, the big action sequence. Thank you so much. Enjoy the premiere. Thank you. Thank you. Tell me a little bit about your role in the movie. Um, I play Detective Frazier, uh, and I, I might be a detective and I might not be a detective. So it's like a, it's a little, uh, it's kind of a weird part. It kind of comes in towards the end and causes a little chaos in these girls' lives, and like like they like they haven't had any so, so far. You know what I mean? Um, how is working with us ensemble? It looks like a very fun cast. Yeah, it was a great cast. All four girls were wonderful, and then. They all bring their own like dynamic to it, and they're all so talented. And I mean, like all these girls, like they're singers and comedians and drama actors. I mean, it's, it was I was really in awe of them the whole summer. What else do you have coming up that you like to share? Uh, I just finished doing a movie with David Spade for Adam Sandler called uh, Who Do You Think Would Win? And I, I just finished the second season of Divorce on HBO with Sarah Jessica. What can fans expect from season two? See, of Divorce? 
Four divorce, <laughs> pretty much. Thank you so much, enjoy the You're welcome, thank you very much.